Hey guys, welcome to the channel. And I want to kind of talk a little bit. I'm sorry, I look like a mess. I look like uh, I look like shit, to be honest with you. I feel that way too. So I, I posted a message there in the community tab, and don't worry, I don't have to tell you where it's at. Um, about doing something stupid. Now, there's some people who thought that maybe I did something online, um, which wasn't the case. Um, but it was still stupid, nevertheless. And um, Chad and Monty and uh, my brother and him, they got to see it firsthand. Well, Ma Monty stayed on the phone with me for six hours um, as I basically self-destructed. Did something really stupid last night. So... You guys know how I talk about depression, right? I, I talk about it all the time. I talk about how, you know, there's good days and bad days. And I don't know what it was. Uh, last night, something triggered me. I don't know what it was. Uh, I started getting things stuck in my head. Like, I'm not good enough. Um, uh, everything was going to go away from me. I started thinking about my best friend that committed suicide. Started thinking about my mom. Started thinking for some odd reason in my head, I thought everybody would be better off without me. Now, I didn't try to commit suicide last night, but it very well could have uh, ended that way um, accidentally. So I take a lot of medication, a lot of medication, heart meds, blood pressure, depression stuff, uh, insulin uh, stuff for my heart and, you know, a lot. I, I take a lot of pills, uh, maybe 20 pills a day. And I can show you guys that is no exaggeration. Um, I can show you that one day. Uh, I, I may have shown it before, but yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, last night, um, started thinking about these things and I, I'm not a big drinker. When I was in college, I used to drink quite a bit. Um, there for a while, I drank a lot. Uh, I got into beer for a while and hard liquor and stuff like that. Uh, never been on drugs though. I've done like high smoke marijuana, um, and Delta eight, which is a derivative of, I guess it's technically hemp. Um, I've done that before, but I've never done drugs. And so I never, you know, still probably, I, w I won't do drugs except for marijuana, I guess. <laughs> but, um, Last night, you know, I, I had some really strong liquor uh, in my cabinet. And I decided, hey, I'm going to take my medication first. On the medicine bottles, it says, do not mix medicine with, you know, marijuana or any substance, stuff like that, or alcohol. It very clearly says that. And I wasn't thinking at all. I wasn't thinking. And I decided to, I, I took three shots, uh, two shots of Jaeger and a big shot of, well, two shots of absinthe and one shot of Jaeger that I remember. Uh, I did confirm that with my brother. He said it was only like two or three shots, but absinthe and Jaeger themselves, especially absinthe, has got a really high alcohol content, especially for somebody, um, you know, but doesn't drink often and... Uh, I had surgery in 2020, and um, it makes alcohol, like, more potent. And that's not counting the, the uh, pills and stuff that I was taking. Um, again, it wasn't me trying to commit suicide. I was just really triggered. I, don't, I can't explain it. And I scared uh, Monty. Uh, I'm pretty sure I scared Chad. Um... You know, going back, taking a look at the conversations that I don't remember having. Um, it's embarrassing, honestly. It is, really is. And, I, you know, I, I feel ashamed that I let myself get that low. But uh, as as all, all the comments that I got from that community post, such, such great people, like, saying these great things, tell me their stories, and, you know... We had people like Anthony uh, Vasquez um, and a few other people, um, you know, especially Legicator and the guys in the chat on Legicator stream uh, going on right now as we speak, as I'm recording this video. 
I didn't want to hop on uh, the stream because I didn't want to drag it down. Um, I never want to do that. I, I, I don't want to stream uh, when I'm down, right? I don't want to do that. And I don't want to pull somebody else's channel down um, a peg because, you know, it's it's a buzzkill. I, I know what it's like. I know how it can be, um, you know, you, you're happy, you're fine, and you're, you're willing to work with people, but, you know, at that same time, the negativity and just the, the sheer sadness of it, uh, it can really tear you down, especially other people that's around you. And I know this, I've, I've been through this for years, and again, I don't know why it, I, I did this. I woke up this morning and my phone was on and Monty was on there, but I don't remember. I don't remember anything from last night. Um, hardly anything. And that's the scary part. You know, usually whenever I drink, I sometimes remember things. I mean, it takes a lot. It took a lot for a long time to get me drunk. And like I said, I normally don't go to alcohol. Um, I, I have before. I'm not going to lie. I've got it, but I've... You know, I don't abuse it, but in some cases when I'm really down and I try to drown things out, that was one of the things I used, and it was very dangerous the way I used it. Um, anyway, it's dangerous, but this was especially dangerous with the medications I take. Um, you know, I'm right now I'm hungover, sick, um, thrown up, and confused of why... I got that low. And again, it wasn't anybody's fault in particular. I don't know why I went down that road. I don't know what dropped me down that low. But for some odd reason, you have a thousand voices in your head telling you you're not good enough. You're a piece of shit. Die. You know, I was saying I don't want to live. Um... Worried about my family not loving me. Worrying about my friends not loving me. Worrying uh, I was going to lose Monty. Uh, war I I read a, t a message where I said, I or, or Monty told me about it, I believe, I forget what it was, that um, I didn't want my friend to die again. My friend has been gone for a while. Uh, I think it was 2019, pretty sure. Um, I, I'm losing track of time, losing track of a lot of things. And that's a side effect of my meds is memory loss. Really bad, actually. And I blame a lot of it on the medications I take, but there, there is an initiate and I'm the initiate. I made that decision, even knowing that that was a bad decision. I did it anyways. And it could have ended very, very badly. Um, and, you know, some people are going to be mad at me because of that. And I understand your anger. I'm angry. I'm angry at myself. But I'm going to do my best to not let that happen again. Um, you know, I have people to talk to, right? I do. I have a lot of people. I have you guys. You know, I can always turn to making videos. But... Like I said, I don't know what got me that, and I apologize for that. Uh, I'm just lucky. I, w I it would have been bad if I was streaming and you guys got to see that firsthand, because um, it probably would have turned you guys away from me. I'm just seeing how things work in my mind. Um, and again, this isn't a woe was me thing. This is me just apologizing and explaining what happened. Uh, I don't want you to feel sorry for me. If anything, I want you to be angry at me. I want you to be mad at me. I want you to be stark raving mad at me for doing that because it was stupid. It was a bad idea. Really bad idea. And sometimes it takes um, a good stern talking to to get through things, right? To understand things. But I didn't commit, I didn't try to commit suicide on purpose. That wasn't the intention. The intention was to drown out what was in my head. But it could have been very bad 
for what the way I'd done it. You know, and Monty could probably explain a lot. I, I don't remember. I did look at some messages I sent to Chad. Um, I'm embarrassed, man. And I, and one of the things I caught from the messages I sent to Chad was saying how I need God, how I need to get saved, um, how I miss my friends. Maybe that's something I need to do. Maybe it's something I that's going to help me. You know, I tried to get back in the church, and this isn't a religious video. This is just me trying to say what was on my head and what maybe I was a sign for me to maybe do things differently. But I'm going to do my best not to allow that happen again. Um, I hope you guys, um, I hope you guys are doing well. Um, and if you want to follow my advice, my advice, and my, you know, I can't follow my own advice most of the time. Just reach out to people. Um, hold on. If you think it's a bad idea and you know it's a bad idea, don't do it. And. Yeah, but I love you guys and I'll see you soon.